in Terry Peak in the Black Hills opened its doors for the first weekend in December. With 20 inches of snow, new snow in the last week, though, skiers and snowboarders are now taking advantage of their winter breaks. Kelloland Sydney Thorson takes us for a ride on the slopes. The snow is falling once again here at Terry Peak, something skiers are happy to see. This year we brought the whole family, three girls and uh, son-in-laws and five grandkids, and uh, we're staying right here in one of the ski-in, ski-outs. Because of the extra snow, Terry Peak was able to open 95% of its slopes by Christmas. And that doesn't happen usually because of weather. Yeah. You know, Mother Nature has to help. We have snowmaking capabilities, but if it's not cold enough, and she's not giving us any natural snow, it's kind of hard to do. So today, Timmy Lippert and I took a ride in the snow mover to get the last ski slope ready for business. Normally by this time, we have made a ton of snow and pumped millions of gallons of water, but like I said, it's been a blessing for Mother Nature to come in and help. So We've already booked for next year. Uh, we've already booked for two years out because uh, things book fast, but it's, it's worth it. While it looks pretty busy here now, Terry Peak officials say that once their last ski slope is open today, there will be more visitors to come. At Terry Peak and Lee, Sydney Thorson, Hello Land News. This weekend is Terry Peak's music series kickoff, where it will host live music events and, of course, more skiing.